just throw that all game. That's <laughs> something else. <laughs> Let's take a look back into the second period and show you how the Oshawa Generals wound up with a 3-2 lead through 40 minutes. And Troy, the second period opened up really well for the Bulldogs. Brandon Sangin would actually get them out to a 2-0 lead before things would go a little bit haywire. Yeah, Brandon Sangin with his, uh, his third shorthanded goal of the season. And that put the uh, Bulldogs up. And then that goal, and then a, the second of the game here from Landry on a real nice pass. And then you'd see the Oshawa Generals come back. It's Nando Egenberger to drop it off for Sarah Noel. Puck comes in and out of the net. Noel would then have a short-handed opportunity that Zach Roy would stand tall on. Yeah, Zach Roy near the pad save there. Noel just couldn't get it up over the pad or the Bulldogs would be in even bigger trouble. Short-handed again, Jack Stadnika on to Kyle McLean, back of the net. Yeah, you're, those two guys, you know, you, 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 it's tough to stop. They're the most talented guys on the team right there. And then power play for the Generals. Stadnika would find Antropov, who slides it through Roy. That made it a 3-2 game. Yeah, all those goals were in high.